satellite and radar still sh uh, coming up dry, but also mostly clear out there. And again, this is going to be another sign of another sunny and mainly dry day across the majority of the state. All thanks to that ridge of high pressure that's going to be strengthening across the Rockies today, then eventually settling across the state as we go into Thursday and Friday, bringing us those daytime highs back in the upper 80s to low 90s and possibly challenging some record highs even right here in Albuquerque. But first things first this morning, uh, waking up on the cool side, so definitely needing the jackets in Southern Colorado, anywhere from Cortez to Durango, Pagosa Springs, we're in the lower to middle 40s, even Towson Raton waking up at 41 degrees this morning with the mid 50s in Clayton, Tucum Carry, Clovis, you're in the lower to middle 50s, Roswell checking in at 63 degrees, milder conditions across southern portions of the state with even Deming and Las Cruces around 60 to 62 degrees, but notice Grants, you're one of the colder spots on the map this morning, dropping down to 39 degrees with the mid 40s out to the west and Gallup. But notice across the northeast and the eastern plains, we're actually waking up to numbers two to even five degrees cooler compared to this time yesterday. All thanks to that backdoor cold front that has swung through the state yesterday afternoon, but also into the evening hours. And that's going to keep temperatures a little bit cooler out toward the eastern plains, including Roswell, as we go into the afternoon. But that ridge will be building across the Rockies today, so we're expecting lots of sunshine and also unseasonably warm daytime highs. In fact, we'll be running about five to even 10 degrees warmer than average for this time of year. Roswell, you were at 95 yesterday. How about 88 for today? But it's not going to last for too long because by tomorrow and even Friday, we'll get back into the lower half of the 90s. Beautiful day in the southwest portions of the state with plentiful sunshine, low relative humidity. Highs are back in those 80s and 90s. Gallup coming in at 85 this afternoon. Farmington at 86 with plentiful sunshine today through Friday and through the weekend. We'll be talking about above average daytime highs in the upper 80s, but cool starts with overnight lows in the 50s. Jama, we're at 77 today. Red River at 68. And Santa Fe, sunny and nice out there. 82 degrees on the board for you, but then by tonight you'll drop into the mid 50s under clear skies. We have the upper 70s in Santa Rosa. Chukum Carey topping out near 81. Clayton, you're at 79 today with Roy at 76. And in the East Mountains, we have 81 out toward the Harris, 79 degrees in Sandia Park, Cedar Crest, warming into the upper 80s from Berlin to Los Lunas and Bosque Farms. We have the mid 80s across the foothills today with Bertolillo and Corrales near 88. Rio Rancho, we're in the upper 80s today with plentiful sunshine. We'll drop into the mid 50s by early Thursday morning. We're at 86 here in Albuquerque by Thursday. We're up to about 89. The record for tomorrow is 91, so it looks like we'll be one or two degrees shy of that. By Friday, it looks like we will hit that 90 degree mark. Again, the record high is 91. So coming pretty close to that, we'll stay with those overnight lows in the upper 50s to low 60s. A nice weekend ahead with plentiful sunshine, highs back in the upper 80s, and then a little bit cooler by early next week. Uh, specifically Tuesday, we'll see mostly sunny skies with a high of 84 with overnight lows in the upper 50s.